All right, I want to show you how easy it can be to install the code using PyP. So the first thing I do is just make a directory, change into the directory. I'm going to set up a virtual environment. So Python 3, and then I call all my virtual environments EMV. Uh, you should be using Python 3.7 or higher. Then you want to activate that. And that's why you see this little ENV right here. And then you want to say pip install GNSS REFL. So unlike using GitHub, uh, it's a little simpler. And hopefully this will work. Has a list of the libraries needed and so on. And we're set to go. I'll just try running one command. Let's just figure out what day of year 2021 May 1st is. The first time you run any of the code, uh, you'll get a slow response as it sets things up. After this comes back with a prompt, it'll be much faster. I'll go ahead and I'll, I'll make an SNR file for you so you can see how it's done. I will say that I have already set up my environment variables, and I've also installed uh, the helper codes that are outlined in the readme file. So this should be considered, um, you know, it, it shows you how it's done and how simple it can be, but you do need those other things. So if I said, for example, lsaxe, you can see that I have executables in that directory. Uh, if I say right next to snr-h, I'll get the inputs you need for that. I can also run it. I'm going to take station P101, the year 2021. I'm going to do the day of year five. It says it exists. So let's try something else. I'm using the same examples all the time, I guess. Let's try station P032. It does go pick up that station file and um, possibly the orbits as well. And we're good to go. So I'm going to say stop and end meeting.